Hi, my name is Yona Zur, and this is a piece I've done together with Oran Katz called The Semi-Living Bory Dolls. Well, there is an, an old story about um, the Guatemalan worry dolls, um, and you can still get those little dolls. Every kid gets um, a box with those dolls, and the kid has to put those dolls, to tell the dolls their worries, and then put them under the pillow with the hope that the dolls will take the worries away. And we thought we should try and, and uh, put some life into those dolls, and maybe the dolls will take those worries away. So we created those dolls out of um, special polymer, biodegradable polymer, and we seeded them with um, living cells, and they are grown in um, bioreactor microgravity, bioreactor, they get all the nutrients that they need, all the food, and they're growing um, in three dimensions, the tissue is growing, taking over the polymer. And we give the option for audience to actually whisper the worries to the doll, and you can use this microphone over here and we collect all those worries. This year, especially in Ireland at this time, they are very unique worries that people have. Originally we thought that we'll talk about um, um, worries and concern in regard to biotechnology, but we realized that people almost treated them as um, wood adults. And some of the worries are very personal and very, um, um, disturbing but also very interesting and uh, it's a document about I guess the state of people at this time. We're doing what's called the killing rituals or the funeral where we ask the audience to um, decide what do we want to do with those life? How do we want to um, stop the life of this life? Because we cannot take those dolls with us, of course, um, on the airplane back to our country. It's very symbolic because when people brush their teeth in the morning, they kill more cells than what you know, we will kill as part of the funeral. But it's, it's a moment to actually um, reflect and, and think about life and death. The reactions are different. I think People, um, over the time, you know, because those dolls will change over time and people who will visit the gallery a um, few times, hopefully will form some relationship with them. So in the killing ritual, some people take it really um, deeply and emotionally. And um, again, the, the, it, it's a very symbolic. And then when we tell them about how symbolic it is, how, you know, cells are being killed on everyday basis without even thinking about it, um, I think it, it um, opens up all sorts of, of thoughts about, you know, how we treat life, how life in the context of art or how life in the context of, if you want science or food, um, is treated um, differently. Mm -hmm.